types of covalent bonding. In this module, you will learn about covalent bonding and its types. The atoms of noble gases, as you already know, have completely filled outermost shells. This makes the noble gases highly stable. Due to high stability, the atoms of noble gases have no tendency to combine or form bonds with other atoms. The atoms of all other elements have a strong tendency to get a stability of the kind that noble gases have. For that, atoms come together and form bonds with each other and achieve the noble gas configuration. Many atoms form a bond by sharing electron pairs with each other. Such bonds that are formed by the mutual sharing of electron pairs between two atoms are called covalent bonds. Let us now understand covalent bonds with the help of an example. A chlorine atom has seven electrons in its valence shell. So, it needs one more electron to attain stability or complete its octet. So, two chlorine atoms come together and share one of their electrons with each other. Thus, there is one shared pair of electrons that belongs to the valence shell of both the chlorine atoms. This way, a molecule of chlorine is formed in which each chlorine atom has eight electrons or a complete octet in its valence shell. A covalent bond that is formed by the sharing of only one pair of electrons between two atoms is called a single covalent bond. A single covalent bond is represented by a single dash between the symbols of two atoms. In the same way, consider an oxygen atom. It has six electrons in its valence shell. Now it needs two more electrons to complete its octet. These it can get from another oxygen atom. So, two oxygen atoms come together and each of these shares two of its electrons with the other. This gives a rise to two shared pairs of electrons that belong to the valence shell of both the atoms. This way, a molecule of oxygen is formed in which each oxygen atom has eight electrons or a complete octet in its valence shell. A covalent bond that is formed by the sharing of two pairs of electrons between two atoms is called a double covalent bond. A double covalent bond is represented by a double dash between the symbols of two atoms. Now consider a nitrogen atom. It has an electronic configuration of 2, 5. So it needs three more electrons to complete its octet. It can get those from another nitrogen atom. Two nitrogen atoms come together and each of these shares three of its electrons with the other. This gives a rise to three shared pairs of electrons that belong to the valence shell of both the atoms. This way, a molecule of nitrogen is formed in which each nitrogen atom has eight electrons or a complete octet in its valence shell. Such a covalent bond that is formed by the sharing of three pairs of electrons between two atoms is called a triple covalent bond. A triple covalent bond is represented by a triple dash between the symbols of two atoms. Let's recap. The atoms of elements other than noble gases form bonds to get the stable noble gas configuration. Bonds that are formed by the mutual sharing of electron pairs between two atoms are called covalent bonds. Covalent bonds are of three types, single, double and triple bond. A single covalent bond is formed by the sharing of one electron pair between two atoms. A double covalent bond is formed by the sharing of two electron pairs between two atoms. A triple covalent bond is formed by the sharing of three electron pairs between two atoms.